up everyone, welcome to Yoga with Adrian. I'm Adrian, and today we have a core strength ritual for you. This is a really great video to supplement with your yoga practice or another workout. Maybe you just went for a run or a nice long walk and you're wanting a little bit more, right? So this is a practice that's just beautiful for your core, right? So whether you're looking to get chiseled for the swimsuit season, or you're just wanting to support your back and prevent back pain, or maybe you're wanting to fly in other yoga postures, this is an exercise that's going to rock your core. So get into something comfy, put on a good attitude, connect to your breath, and let's get started. exhale to release awesome work all right so scoop the tailbone again so that lower back is nice and flush with the mat and then just take a second again to breathe deep open the elbows nice and wide all right here we go inhale in exhale lift the head the neck the shoulders up just take a second here to create a little hammock for the neck and then we're gonna slowly lift the chin up towards the sky engaging the muscles of the abdominal wall exhale lift Three more, you got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Last one, in where we were. Inhale in, exhale, lifting the chest. See if you can really lift your shoulders again, not crunching here, but looking up towards the ceiling. So peek at the video when you need to, but then take your gaze straight up and slightly back, almost as if you're looking up past your third eye here. All right, we're coming back here to engage, scooping the tailbone, shoulders nice and high. Let it hover. And inhale, bring it in all the way up towards the sky. Lots of energy through the feet here. Carving a line through space with your right heel. You can also come here to interlace the fingertips, but I like to keep my arms extended. Now, energetically, I'm keeping my tailbone up, lower back, pressing flush down to the mat. And lower, let it hover, engage full abdominal wall, and then reach it back up, knees together. Here we go. Moving in your own time. Resist the urge to rush this, so slow and steady, toning the core. Great, from here we're gonna to move to butterfly crunches. So interlace the fingertips, bring them behind. Nice long length here first. And then baby crunches, it's important to not think about the crunch happening in your neck, but in the muscles of the abdominal wall. So keep your gaze straight up and back, chin lifted towards the sky, and just baby pulses here. Awesome work, we're almost done here. Really, really awesome. We're gonna take a second to just cross the right leg over the left and find cow legs here. You might grab the big toes or the outer edges of the feet. Big breath in. Big breath out as you unravel. Take the left leg over, grab the outer edge. Beautiful, breathing deep. And then we'll unravel here. Bring the knees right underneath the hip point, your knee knees. rather than your knee to your elbow. So coming here, then we'll come back to center. And crossing over, left elbow to right knee. Really reach the elbow to the knee rather than the knee to the elbow. Inhale to center, center, down. Center, cross, thighs. Squeeze the knees in, relax your shoulders, take a deep breath in through the nose. Take your hips to the right side of your mat, just a hair, and allow your legs to fall over towards the left. Great, interlace the fingertips behind the head. Back to center. This time, left leg all the way over the right. <clears throat> Inhale in, exhale, let the weight of the legs melt to the right. Did I walk my hips over? Walk your hips over. Interlace behind. Give yourself a great big bear hug here. And one last move. Here we go. Slide the hands to the backs of the thighs. Take a second to just shake it off. We'll rock all the way up and come into a plank pose. All right, almost this there. This variation is gonna be on the elbows. Shoulder width apart to start. Come on to your forearm plank here. Spike the heels towards the back wall. You know you can always, or the back edge of your mat, you know you can always lower the knees here. Come into a variation. But for now, give it a try. Spike the heels back. Draw the shoulders away from the ears. And we're going to breathe here with the gaze straight down. Draw the navel. Hug the lower back ribs. to center. Left toes off the mat. You got it. Back to center. Full body strengthener here to the right. Back to center. 
and to the left. If you want to spike this up for a little more cardio, a little toe jacks, you can do both at the same time. But otherwise, we're keeping it nice and slow and mindful today, building heat, toning the body. Side to side, press away from your yoga mat, okay, straight down. Great, do one more on each side, you got this. And then slowly release knees to the ground, send the sitting bones back, hips back, and child's pose. Catch your breath, breathe deep. All right, that was just your warm up for this next thing. Ha <laughs> ha, come on, leg on, uh, onto the earth. So top foot comes onto the earth and we still lift the hips up high. Take it to the other side. So take a little break if you need to in between. And take it to the other side whenever you're ready. Stacking the hips. You're doing awesome. Let's do one more, you got it. Press away from your yoga mat. Full body experience. And then release. Big breath out. Tuck your chin into your chest. And slowly roll it up. Counter twist. Right hand comes to the left thigh. Left fingertips behind. Sit up nice and tall. Inhale. Exhale, twist. Take it to the other side. Big inhale to lift up. Big exhale to twist. Inhale back to center. And draw the hands at the heart. Cool. Alrighty, my friends, awesome work. If you're doing this practice with someone, go ahead and give them a high five right now. If you're doing it alone like me, high five right up to the screen or in the air. Um, really nice work. This is a great video that you can repeat. So if you're wanting more, you can do different reps. You can do this video twice, even three times in a row to really get uh, your core smiling and on fire. Um, also really great to support you in other practices, like I said before. Uh, favorite this video, bookmark it so you can return to it easily, share it with your friends, and don't forget that first things first, self-love, really accepting where you're at today, and just making it a fun experience on your mat. That's why I love this channel, that's why I love you. So let me hear from you, questions, comments down below, and I'll see you next time. Free videos every Wednesday. Peace. Namaste.